We have another update tonight on those giant African land snails found in the Newport Ritchie area in Pasco County. State lab testing reveals some of them are carrying a dangerous parasite. Stacy Scheibel joins us now live in the studio with the details. Stacy, it uh, doesn't sound very good. No, it doesn't. And just the name of this parasite is kind of frightening. It's called the rat lungworm parasite, and it can be dangerous to the health of humans and animals. If you see one of these, look, but don't touch. The battle to eradicate these giant African land snails found in Pasco County is more urgent than ever. Some have tested positive for the rat lungworm parasite, which can cause meningitis in humans and animals. It's still the same game plan with treatment and survey, but it helps us make the public more aware that, hey, don't be handling these things. This could, you know, it could be a health issue as well. The Florida Department of Agriculture has a team of 30 working on this invasive snail problem. They demonstrated for us today how they're using dogs and pesticide to try and get rid of the snails, which can sometimes be hard to spot during the day. They obviously love cool places and it only gets cool in Florida in the evenings and overnight. Um, so they are more active. It's been almost a month since the snails were first spotted in Newport Ritchie. Officials showed us today how large the snails can grow up to eight inches. They consume 500 different kinds of plants and can feed on plaster and stucco as well. This is the third time the snails have shown up in Florida, but the team tackling the problem feels good about the quarantine zone they've set up. It's very concentrated, which is good. That means that population hasn't really moved out that far. So we continue to do surveys outside of the zone. And we're not finding anything out there, which is really good. So to reiterate, if you see one of those snails, don't touch it, but do report it. There's actually a snail hotline, the number 888-397-1517. Again, 888-397-1517. And you guys, there is a bit of good news. They move at a snail's pace. <laughs> I was going to say, they're not going to get away real fast. No, so the good news is they think they've got them in yeah, that area, them and they're surrounded. treating even uh, like areas around there that haven't had any. But they eat stucco and uh, plaster, too. They're big. They're hungry, apparently. Wow. It's gross. Mm -hmm. That is gross. Thank really you. Is. Thank you.